Hello and welcome back to OMSI Instructional Video 2. Um, we uh, discussed the um, dashboard and just all of the controls inside the bus in the last video, so if you missed that, please go back and check it out. Uh, the link is in the description and at the end of this video, so uh, don't forget to uh, go check that out if you missed it. Um, this bus is a little bit different. Uh, it, it pretty much looks the same, and we're the same number at the same destination. It's just a few things have changed around a little bit. Nothing major, though. It pretty much looks the same. Uh, steering wheel, same horn, everything is good. So, to reset a view, so say, like, I go off in this direction and I want to reset it. You just press F1, or, I, I'm sorry, uh, I've forgotten how to do it. Um, alright. I don't remember how to reset the view, guys. It, it was it was some button somewhere. But anyway. Oh, it's space. Okay. So you press space to reset the view. Alright, so to drive, you need a numpad. If not, you can edit the controls or just press O. Okay, so pressing O, you, you kind of have a mouse control. Up to accelerate, down to brake, left and right to steer. Uh, but we're going to steer using the numpad which is 8, 4, 6, and 2. Um, to begin, you need to let go, let off of your parking brake and circle around to the first bus station. Um, the bus does get a little loud, so I might be talking a little louder than normal. But uh, here we go, guys. Uh, it doesn't look like there is anyone in, at this bus stop that wants to get on. I'm going to turn on the arrows to tell me where to go. Uh, so let, let's just continue on to the next bus station, since there's no one that wants to get on here. Uh, driving controls are pretty basic. Uh, you just gotta remember that you're driving a large vehicle. And you shouldn't have a problem. Uh, the brake is very sensitive, so, uh, make sure you are easy on that. Uh, you can switch to this view to view the uh, red light and things like that. Uh, you follow the yellow arrows, and it's pretty simple. You just stop at the H's, and yeah, for some reason that's a thing. Uh, and let's go. Again, you got to remember you're driving a bus. It's not a car. You need to make wider turns, etc. Oh, which I almost failed it there. Oh, yeah, okay. Well, I'm not the best driver yet, but I will be. So open your doors and hope that people get on. I don't know. This game is weird. It acts up sometimes. But normally people would be getting on now. When you're done, you just close the doors up and click the lock. And off we go. <laughs> so pretty much it's just driving around and following your route. And uh, th this is actually going to be a pretty short video, guys. Um, there's actually not much more to this game. Um, there is a scary map, and I'm not going to play on the scary map yet, because, again, I really suck at this game. But um, I, I just thought I would give you a, a brief... a um, brief example of how to do this game. Uh, and it's actually pretty simple once you get the hang of it. Uh, shifting gears is important if you're going up and down hills and things like that. But, uh, for the most part, you won't be using them. And, uh, that, yeah, that's pretty much it. Uh, you can crash into things and bad things might happen. Uh, but for the most part, that is the extent of this game. Just driving around and transporting people. Whoa, okay, I almost hit that guy. Uh, and yeah, that that is that is OMSI Bus Simulator. Or OMSI Der Bus Simulator, uh, depending on what country you live in. Uh, it, it is a very fun game. I mean, I love it. It 
it, the sound effects in it are just amazing, the graphics aren't that bad, and the, the controls actually make you, it feels like you're actually driving a giant bus. I mean, it it is very realistic and very uh, a serious approach to uh, buses and how to drive them. So, I, like I said, if you have any any interest in driving buses, or if you're a bus driver and you love your job, and you want to drive more buses, then buy this game. I believe it's just about 30 US dollars on the company website. I'll leave a link in the description. Uh, and and that, that, that's pretty much it. I mean, like, even people walking, like that, that woman there, they, they don't look that bad. I mean, I've seen games that, simulator games, that people just look like unhuman. They, they look inhuman when they walk, and... <laughs> Well, I, I mean, there's a few issues in the game, like, you know, that sign over there that I hit, that, that blue sign is kind of just waving back and forth in the background. But, I mean, for the most part, it's a very fun game, and I would recommend it to anyone who loves driving simulators. It is definitely worth the money, and it's just a beautiful game. So, uh, if, you, if you have any uh, questions, comments about this game, please comment or message me. I, I will try my best to... Sub or, uh, I'll try my best to reply to all of them. Uh, it, it is a complicated game, but once you get the hang of it, like I said, it is very, very enjoyable. So I hope you enjoyed, and please don't forget to subscribe, like, share, and favorite. I will see you guys next time.